Hello you guys, the Sutby Panda Guy here and welcome back to another Robux video. Today we were back on Ice Cream Van Simulator and this and today is the update where they added the plane and some other bits as well. Um, no, actually it's just the plane and um, um, the plane is actually a hundred billion cash. Um, let me just show you. But today, I've unlocked myself a boat, so this video is going to, all, going to be about this boat that I've got. And then hopefully the next episode, we will end up checking out this plane. So we're not actually that far away as, as it seems, because um, as I keep developing and making profits, I could actually um, reach to this um, mark. So, But today is going to be all about my boat, so... It may be interesting to you guys, or uh, it may be not interesting for people that are, who are complete um, pros at this game, shall I say, like highly ranked and literally unlocked everything and probably at the playing point now. So um, I just want to show the boat anyways, because since I bought it, um, I, think, I think it was a hundred, five hundred million of, I think it was one billion, I think. But um, let me just show you, um, before I do that, I have to fill my boat with some ice cream. Well, actually, my boat only carries slushies, so. I normally pick the expensive ones when you figure out where the mostly all these um, color categories um, normally, lo normally where they located from, so. Um, so let's keep kicking along. Okay, and let me just try and get up to 10, impossible, there we go, okay, okay, so, it's spawn very cool, um, well we're actually going to teleport to the harbour, and this is my boat, Ross Panda Blocks' boat, so this is mine, as you can see I can drive into it, so, for the rest of the video, I think this video will maybe a bit short, I don't know, um, it may be a bit long, or maybe at normal, but I mean, this is all about this boat in this video. And then hopefully next video, I think I'll bet that I'll be able to unlock the plane when I reach to the uh, 100 billion cash mark. Because we're not really that far off now, even though we just bought some... Um, some um, Oh, what do you call them? We call them, for me, I call them slush puppies, slushies. Oh yeah, slushies, that's right. <laughs> and, um, Yummy. um, I forgot what I was gonna say now. Uh, oh yeah, once you just keep giving all of your slushies, you'll get like an extra 50% kind of profit along with it. Yummy. So you pay for it and you get an extra half of the amount, which is pretty cool. Yummy. Well, I don't think exactly half, but I think maybe like a 30% extra or something. Thanks. Someone's got the check, used the checkpoint here just to save them traveling all the way. Yummy. Which I understand mm. that. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I ran out of those um, like pale pink ones. Mm. The yellow ones are more expensive. Mm. So we just have to wait along a bit until they actually appear. So I can only do the dark purples and yellows at the moment. Yummy. Ice cream. But once again, this Ice cream. this game with um with these sound effects and this that, it just brings a bit of kind of realism. I mean like some, you know, like adding like real voiceovers and that, which is pretty cool. Um, for me, I might probably use text to speech, Yummy. but I think real voices kind of represents, um, like it's a bit more natural, should I say. There's a word behind it, but I can't seem to figure it out. Um, okay, we got a lot of pale pink ones. Um, so in that case, um, normally I'll do it all at once, but sometimes we can get in a bit of a stuck when there's mostly all pale pinks and 
and there's no other colors that I've got in my um, my storage so and in fact um, I'm just gonna go back into the center now don't worry this is not gonna be a long journey because I can just teleport in that so let's get some pale pink ones oh cutting cotton candy and grape slushies get some pinks because they're morely often shown because the more expensive the um, the color categories are the more like they're kind of a bit hard to well they they don't really appear that much than um, the cheaper ones so you just have to um, you have to be really careful of how much you put in your storage, even though you can put it into the waste bin, but you will kind of lose a little bit of profit. But um, but you'll get like 25% of the amount you brought. So I bought loads, so I probably just got like maybe 1 billion or two, something. Something like that. Okay, we're back here again. Now let's give all the ice cream to the pale pink ones. Well, they're not really pale pink, but <laughs> well, they're just pink. It's just because I'm looked at dark purple, and I just kind of called it pale pink. Click on everybody. Hopefully, next episode, I think we will better. I think we can do it. Is be able to unlock the plane which is the highest ranked um, kind of miracle in um, this game so far at the moment I don't know what else can be a higher upgrade besides the plane and I believe that um, how the plane works is um, it's some sort of airport or like where you put your airplane in and you go across the sky and um, I think it says on here deliver air mail with the plane um, I was about to say like meeting people on the clouds and I'm just like what are they even doing on the clouds but I think it's maybe a quicker way to um, drop some ice cream off or something like that I, I don't know what, what could be a side uh, kind of a good thing such as you know saves you do, doing something hard you can just um, do something instantly by the magic of a click or something I don't know <laughs> that's what just what I think so I'm basically in this video just clicking on people and just talking about uh the plane and even though this video is meant to be on the boat but this boat's actually pretty good it's good to have experience by using transport on like in the sea basically and going and reaching um and winching points Yummy. okay so purples and pinks thanks, thanks. Mm. Yummy. So we just waiting on a bit. As you can see, you guys, I had like 10 billion before. Now I've actually got myself more of a profit now. Yummy. Mm. So once you keep saying this and that, you'll gain an extra more credit, uh, more cash than what you brought and then what you receive by giving them. Um, yeah, so I'm stuck with the purples now and there's rarely ever any purples mm. here. So in that case, Let's just teleport. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, back into the center to the ice cream shop. And get myself some yellows. Get some more grapes. And some more grapes. And some pinks. And some pinks. And some yellows. Normally I would wish to go for all for yellows, but it's quite risky because the yellows, r people, uh, the people in the yellow shirt rarely ever appear. So you're, you're kind of wasting, you know, you're filling up your storage with nothing basically when you can use it, but you can't really, um, 
like when the characters are not there you're kind of a bit screwed because you haven't got any room and you can't mix and match flavors into sections or anything it has to be separately of course so that's a kind of a tip that I kind of learnt for myself when starting to play this game, so... Right, we're back here Yummy. again. Let's click on everybody now. Yummy! Yummy! Okay. Let's wait a little bit. Do, 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 do. Someone who placed the checkpoint here is already here, but he seems to be away from keyboards. Because and another struggle is that, which is very normal and it can be annoying, but it, no one can't really help it on this one because basically it's like when you find the right color character you want to click on, and you got some other stranger with you, you're more likely going to have a fight with each other like who's going to sell more ice cream or who's going to sell this to this person first by just clicking on them so you kind of have to be really quick with that and that's very normal I think by the time I just finish giving out all these slushies I'm probably just gonna end the video or actually before I end the video, I just want to show you a tour around. Of course, I want to show you a tour around. Especially for the people that unfortunately have no access to the other side of the island. So, um, just keep watching. I'm just basically feeding slushies to people. Oh yeah, I ran out of yellows. Yeah, okay. We just have to wait a little on the bits. We could just come back. We don't... Sometimes they come up quite a while, so I just let me just show you a little tour. Let me just try and pull myself out of it. Ah! Oh no! There we go. Okay. So there's the iceberg, and there's actually uh, people inside in there. And we have got an island with some huts with some people there. And you got some kind of dry land here with some red people and some blues up the top. I can't really zoom out, unfortunately. And oh, yeah, and there's a, like a headquarters here of the ice. I think, yeah, this is the headquarters. Um, I paid a hundred million cash for that um, that's only like um, if you get access to it I'm thinking that may be a way to um, where your plane would be um, looked after at. I think it's at that point I believe I haven't done research so I'm, I'm just just presuming that if it's true or not I'm just making things up <laughs> so let's have a drive around Yeah, this game is really colourful. I just like colourful games very much. Even though sometimes colourful games can be, you know, can be too bright, which can, um, you know, kind of give you a bit more of a nice strain. But um, which, which I just like to, I just like games when they're just perfectly colourful, not too bright, not too uh, dark, just like all normal, just. Just like a colourful world with just a, with some shadowing and things like that. So yeah, <laughs> especially for people who um, you know you know get headaches by looking at bright colours on the screen and that. So let's go back into the cave, and it doesn't matter if we um, um, not you know um, if we don't if we haven't sold any um, any slush or the entire slushies that I got there which is the two purples and the pinks but they'll always be kept in your storage so they will all go they, they won't be there forever they they can they just kept nice and safe until the next time you come here which um, like you don't really have to uh, wait that often they just like it's like once you kind of get rid 
get rid of a character by giving them a slushie, they'll replace them with a random one. So you can't always be doomed with it. Like dooms that you're not going to get the matching coloured person from your slushie or your ice cream, shall I say. So we got some here. And the purple. Yeah. Yeah, there's mostly a lot of the yellows here, but I'm just going to end the video. So I gave you a tour around, uh, around the place in my boat. And, um, and then I was, now I'm just climbing right now randomly while I'm just talking. Um, so this is just a video about the boat I just bought. Um, I played this game, um, a few hours ago and I just decided to go back and make a video of it. Unfortunately, I was wasn't recording when I got the boat, which I should really just kind of just brings a little bit of a um, it brings something into the video. Like you start off with something and then you want to show your reaction to it, but I just I just I just went for it and just continued playing without even recording. So that's my bad. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below what you think of this video. You can leave any requests in the comments of what games you should play next, you some Roblox or outside Roblox. And if you're bad to the channel, please be sure to subscribe. And once you subscribe, please turn post notifications, which is the bell, right next to the subscribe button. So that way, you won't miss a new video from me whenever I upload. So like I said, thank you for watching and have a good day.